Found out his, his good personal friends call him the commish. Ladies and gentlemen, please help me welcome the commish, Mr. Tom Brown. After that introduction, I'd probably be smart to just say thank you and, and stand off. <laughs> but before the stopwatch gets on me, I, I want to introduce my family, and, and I have several friends here today, but my wife, I have three of my daughters here, four of my granddaughters, and husbands and fiancés of our grandkids, my brother, my sister, uh, who have all uh, made it here today for this special day and and I appreciate them being here as you know when you're in this kind of business uh, families don't always come first uh, the time you spend doing your job takes away from the time that you'd be with your family and so I want them to know how much I appreciate uh, staying with me and all the times that I was gone that they were able to uh, keep the, the home running and keep things going. And I have several friends who came here today and former teammates. I'm sure they're here to make sure this really is going to happen. And, <laughs> and I thank them for being here. Uh, like so many others, uh, you, don't, you become what you are because of the help of an awful lot of people. And uh, first of all, I'd like to thank the, the board uh, for nominating me and then the membership for supporting that nomination. Uh, I am both flattered and humbled uh, by this great honor. When I first started playing athletics, and athletics has been such a great part of my life, uh, I am the proverbial sport nut. However, today I'm not alone. Uh, I'm in a group with other people. I've always looked at this event as kind of a mini convention of sport nuts. And, and it's good to be among you. My background, uh, going to St. Andrews, I was, I was uh, fortunate to have a coach by the name of Gene Glick and another one, Garrett Weirda, uh, at Central Michigan, uh, Bill Tennyson, Bill Kelly, and uh, also uh, Joey James, who was, and three of those people have been introduct, inducted into this Hall of Fame, Joey James, Gene Glick, and Bill Kelly. They not only helped hone my athletic skills, but they also honed my skills for the game of life. And I appreciate that very much. Uh, my first job was in Bad Axe. Uh, there I became associated with Claude Marsh, who most people know now as the Golden Greek. Uh, Claude was very instrumental in taking me, I was a 23-year-old kid out of uh, Central Michigan, and taught me two major things. One, how to handle the young men that we were dealing with, and two, how to prepare for a game. He was a master at both of those. Central Michigan was, was very good to me, and uh, when I uh, went back uh, after graduating, I was a mid-year graduate, and uh, I stayed there and worked out to get ready for my stint with the Washington Senators and help coach the freshman basketball team. But one of the things that, that happened uh, there was that I, I learned a lot about what you want to do and what you want to be when you get out of school. And I appreciate that. I, I owe a great deal of credit to the two co-founders of Northwood, Arthur Turner and Gary Stauffer, who took a chance on a 26-year-old guy to bring him in to head their basketball program and eventually to teach him uh, management and promotion skills that they, then they let me practice unencumbered. And I appreciate that very much. My, uh, I've been blessed in my life that I have not had many missed opportunities. But probably the closest coming to miss an opportunity was with the GLIAC. 
in 1992 when the GLIAC came to ask me to be the commissioner to replace Vern Norris, I was uh, not really enamored with that job and I didn't think I wanted to do it. But with some strong encouragement from my wife and some of the athletic directors in the conference, I agreed to interview and the rest is history. I spent 17 years as the commissioner of the GLIAC and it was a mutually beneficial uh, job. But probably the, the greatest thank you that I owe is to my father. When I graduated from high school, I was bound and determined I was going to sign with the St. Louis Cardinals to play, play professional football. My father was just as adamant that I was going to go to college. Now you have to understand, my father had a sixth grade education. And after I got through college, I silently thanked him every day for taking that tough stand. Because I know that if he had not done that, I would not be at this podium today. I want to thank the uh, Don Bethune and the other founders of this organization for taking the time to go after their dream so some of, others, uh, some of us could realize our dream as being a part of it. And I also want to congratulate the other inductees today. And I want you to know that I am pleased that our names will forever be linked as a class of 2012. It's great to be honored for something you really enjoy doing. Thank you very much.